Here are five books for every musical theater writer. Number one, Save the Cat. Now technically this is a book written for film writers, but it's really all about storytelling, and so it applies to writers of all kinds. If you enjoy some real talk mixed in with some humor and some golden nuggets of information, then this book is a must read. Blake Snyder reveals the secrets of captivating storytelling that are hidden in plain sight and breaks them down into actionable items for you to use. Plus, you know, Cats, kittens not included. The concepts in this book really helped me rewrite the opening of The King's Legacy and finally get the opening of the show to where it wanted to be and needed to be. Hey everyone, I'm Michael Ratty, aka Musical Theater Writer Guy. Musical Theater Writer Guy. That's me. Thanks for being here with me today as we look at five books for every musical theater writer. Links to all of these books can be found in the description below, so make sure to check those out. All right, let's get back to it. Number two, The Writer's Journey. If we're talking about story structure, there is no better eye-opening, captivating read than Christopher Vogler's The Writer's Journey. This book is also framed as though speaking to screenwriters, but the concepts here that are being talked about are truly universal. And it's a, it's a down-to-earth, easily digestible, and also a fascinating read. Vogler breaks down the universal components of storytelling and provides well-known everyday examples of how they can be used in stories that all of us know, like The Wizard of Oz or even Star Wars. And if any of you have a soft spot for mythology or fantasy, then it just makes this book an even more interesting read. Number three, Finishing the Hat and Look, I Made a Hat. Yes, yes, I know that technically speaking, these are actually two separate books, but really they were written as one compilation of Stephen Sondheim's story. So I'm gonna consider it one. Plus they're even sold together. Link in the description below. Anyway, let's keep going. There's no better book on the planet that can give the insights into musical theater, lyric writing, storytelling, and structure than these two compilation books. And they are filled with anecdotes of Stephen Sondheim's life and his career, and you actually get to watch the progression of his writing from the beginning all the way until now. Sondheim has been called the master of musical theater lyrics for a reason. So the amount of information that you can glean from these two books is truly invaluable. P.S. If you're getting value or any good information out of this video, I'd really appreciate it if you gave it a little like. Thanks. Number four, Creativity Inc. This one might seem a little bit strange for me to include on the list, considering that Ed Catmull wasn't really a writer at Pixar, but hear me out. Pixar is a company that was founded on the idea of telling good stories. The mission, the vision, and the heart of the company and their films and everything they produce is top-notch, perfectly crafted, and well-executed storytelling. If you know anything about this channel, I am all about good storytelling. Not only will you get a sense of how they were able to determine at Pixar what kind of stories and types of storytelling work best, but you'll also get all these great behind the scenes stories of collaboration and creativity. And not to mention that you will learn quite a few life lessons reading this book as well. Number five, Sondheim on Music. Now, before you complain that there's a second Sondheim book on the list, it is a bit Sondheim heavy, this shelf, isn't it? Well, I'd like to remind you that actually this book was not written by Stephen Sondheim. It's a series of interviews that were conducted by the author, Mark Eden Horowitz, and then they were curated and combined into this compilation. In this book, you'll find information on how Stephen Sondheim approaches musical composition, but also the way that he approaches the structures of musical theater. Not to mention that there are some great stories in here of musical theater giants of the past, and you get to hear stories of collaboration and creation behind the scenes as well. Sondheim discusses music in a way that really opened my eyes to possibilities as a young musical theater writer and a, a new composer in getting a behind the scenes look at the life of such a prolific 
stage writer is fascinating and also very, very entertaining. And there you have it, fellow cast members, five books for every musical theater writer. Don't forget that links to all of these books are available in the description below, and do check those out. Let me know in the comments, what are your favorite books for musical theater writers or writers in general? I'm always looking for new recommendations on things to read, so I'd love to find out. You can check out some of the other videos on the channel. Otherwise, thank you all for being here with me today, and I'll see you again soon. Cheers!